Gusto police got some backup today from one very special recruit. And as KCRA 3 photojournalist Mike Carroll shows us, well, she was made an officer for the day. This could be a glimpse into her future. <laughs> Bailey Hankins, a cheerleader at Fire High School in Modesto, is not used to having people cheering for her. It's different, <laughs> but it is cool that they're all here. High school can be a dramatic experience for anyone, but for Bailey Hankins, the year started out with her mother being diagnosed with cancer. I've actually had melanoma in January, and then in May I was diagnosed with um, intermediate thyroid cancer. Then one month into Bailey's junior year of high school. Well, she's normally very active, always wanting to go, and she was just really tired. We knew she was sick is when she started missing practice. She wasn't really there anymore. Bailey was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. I think we were kind of all shocked. Like, we love Bailey, and to hear that this happened. I feel like it all pushed us to really, like, work harder for her. She's been on chemotherapy. She goes every other week to UCSF. Family friend uh, Teresa Mankey not. told CHP K-9 officer Matt Fowler about Bailey and her interest in wanting to go into law enforcement. She uh, dreams of being a police officer and uh, specifically a K-9 officer. Fowler arranged for Bailey to have a ride along. I said, you know what, I got to turn a, a ride along into a, a much bigger day for her. A day that included a ride along in a CHP car and a Stanislaw County Sheriff's helicopter. Took her over the high school, took her over uh, her house. Then, landing at the Stanislaw County Sheriff's Department, Bailey was greeted by 30 police canines from a dozen different departments around Northern California. Today, her smile is just from ear to ear. It's a wonderful thing. Teenagers are affected too, and children cancer only gets 4% of funding. You know, that's not okay. We need to get much more research funding for these kids. It's just incredible that everyone came out here and wants to support me. This is the very first viral launch she's ever done, so it's an epic one, to say the least. In Modesto, I'm Mike Carroll, KCRA 3 News. Mm. Well, in addition to the ride-along in the K-9 patrol unit and, of course, the Stanislaus County helicopter, Bailey was also presented with police department patches from, get this, 120 different agencies, not only across the country, but also all around the world. Pretty cool. That is a heck of a get well card, isn't it? Well, mm -hmm. again, Bailey has four remaining chemo treatments, which should be completed in April. She's looking forward to being back at Byer High School in Modesto for the fall term, and we wish her well, of course. And her mother is Absolutely. As well.